at my Walgreens this week and Brad, I think you just got lucky, brother. Yep, I got you, Brad. And let's see. Legends wise. You don't see that one every day. They must have found somebody that hid one. But looks like that is it though. And do we do? Yeah. Bunch of old stuff. They ain't never gonna sell those. And I'm actually looking for the kid boo, which I have no idea what wave that one's from. Maybe that's a newer wave after those. But looks like that's gonna be all she wrote. All right, we'll see y'all at the next stop. Laters. All right, we're at Target. Looking for Refractor. It's a new wave. Because uh, I want to build Reflector. You know, hey, that's his real name. But, hey, scrap metal. I'm still building that Debbie. That's for sure. And, looks like that. And, Moloch. No refractors here. It just came out, so I'm expecting about a month delay, like usual for me. They got two white ragers. Zed's gone, like always. And they haven't had new Star Wars since that. One day I got lucky and found that uh, the new vintage wave. And for Legends, Gargoyle, Star Force, out the Yin Yang. And Deadpool. And we got two more of the Craven two packs. And I think that's gonna do it, people. And shout out to my boy Doo Dog. He got me that uh, Fortnite figure, Ralphie. So thank you, brother. I appreciate you. And don't forget to on um, Friday. I'm trying to get this video up probably tomorrow on Thursday. Today's Wednesday. On Friday, it will be. T Man 978, Plastic Attic, Tech Chucker, Doo Dog, Life with Brock, and myself going over our top five figures of 2019. So stay tuned. All right. Let's go see what Nucky's got. All right. Let's see. As uh, T Man would say, obligatory cart sound. Uh, nothing. Not saying a whole lot of nothing. And, yeah, I knew all them turtles would be gone from NECA. All we got is all these Aliens vs. Predator video game ones. And a Lonely Oak Terminator up there. So, that's going to end it for Tarjay. Maybe we'll get lucky. Hey, Die Hard. Look at that. A diehard Christmas. John McClain. All right. See you at the next stop. Latest. All right. Let's see what they got today. Mm. Not a lot. Uh, I do have X-Men away. So, they must have got a restart earlier. So, all right, it's gone. <laughs> and got some lightning collection. And doggy ranger. Let's see. And let's see what they got for the bots. Same old criminals. They got restocks of wave one, wave two, but no refractor from wave three or anything so i think we're gonna call it if you guys realize i only got three stores in my town i can go to and that's because that's all i got so stick with me see the hall wait next to me later hello my people it is your running from county me um we went on a small little hunt we did find some stuff um not for me but for a couple other people so what we did find 
That's my boy, Brad Campbell. He wanted this uh, Spirit Spider from Walgreens, Walgreens exclusive. Um, got it for him. So, Brad, I got you. And then I went to GameStop. Now, they had some stuff there. Um, but we got lucky. We found the new um, in Hulk Booger Peter in Game Wave. And this, of course, is Shuri. Uh, this is for T-Man 978. Found hit for him. Um, so it's going to be going out to YouTube, brother, soon. So glad to find it for you. Um, he's been looking all everywhere for it, I guess, too, recently. Um, so, yeah. So we'll see if he actually watches my videos now because that'll be coming to him. All right. All right. So we did get some boxes mail. If you guys remember my last video, I did say I had some comics coming in. Um, so, so let's show you. This is courtesy, of course, from Mike Pizzini, the Geek Italian. Uh, so Geek Italian Comics um, definitely does some great stuff out there. You guys probably see me share this stuff out there on Cindy Comics. Uh, he does auctions usually every week. Um, got some great stuff on there. Definitely want to hit him up if you need comics. Uh, great dude, He's taken care of me for years. Uh, but we've had this go for a while. I've got a massive amount of books I'm going to be coming from Mike soon. So that'll get its own video down the road. But this was the last uh, slab I was waiting on to come back. And let's see. I don't know what this one is. Let's see. What did it come back as? Ah, uh, I'll take that. I'll take that any day over day of Sundays. And it is an 8.0. This is Amazing Spider Man 299 Venom Cameo. I was actually after the set to get. Um, 298, 299, and 300. Of course, 298 being the first Todd McFarlane. This, of course, Todd McFarlane art as well. Um, so definitely wanted to get this to go with it. This actually it went back to a time where um, Brandon Fields, a good friend of both uh, Fuzz and mine, had went through a bad situation back during Christmas time frame. So we had a uh, big benefit for him, and it worked out great. Um, I was able to get this book, so I had Fuzz press and clean it and then submit it in, and then it finally got to me today. So, Fuzz, thank you so much. I appreciate you, brother. All right. And we got, we got a bunch of boxes. You know how we do it, people. This one's from my boy, and I actually want to take two seconds before I say it. So this is from Dudo. So if you guys don't know, tomorrow night on or tomorrow night or today, depending on when this video gets up. Uh, Doo Dog, Plastic Addict, Tech Chucker, Life with Brock, myself, and T Man 978. We're we'll going over our top um, five figures of 2019 so far. Um, so if you get a chance, I put it, uh, links and stuff out there on both the Syndicate as well as for my YouTube channel. Go check it out tomorrow night, 6 30 Pacific, uh, 9 30 Eastern. So yeah. Like I said, this box is from my boy Doo Dog. He found, um, there's a little story. Usually there is always a story. Um, and I'll get to the story once we get further along in this box. I like that we used a Mesco box for it too. Uh, but, but that's also why I use a knife. Makes life a little bit easier. All right, first up we got Fortnite, and you guys, um, so this is, of course, you guys know I was looking for Ralphie, uh, wanted to get, come back, come back here, uh, wanted Ralphie to put in my uh, collection, so definitely wanted him, um, like I said, he looks like Ralphie enough for me, so definitely wanted to get him, so thank you, dude, appreciate it, brother, story time, all right. So you guys might have seen that I've been doing Transformer sales and whatnot and stuff. Yes, I have. 
Um, but I'm still keeping these ones because I want to build this. I still want to build this Devastator. Um, I broke my Rampage. I actually dropped him off of the shelf and his head broke off. Um, and it actually broke off at the nub piece and the nubs actually broke, so to speak. Um, but I needed it so I can keep building it. So Dew was able to find this and this for me. So thank you, bro. I appreciate you. Definitely wanted this. Yeah, buddy. I'm excited for this. It's Comics. You guys know me. All right. Next up, we have, I had a trade uh, last week with Moria. Mauricio. Uh, Solar Zano. So we did a trade uh, for some bots. Uh, so traded him that, and you shall see what's in said box for it. It's nothing huge, so to speak. Um, just to tell you straight up, it was just a simple trade I needed to do um, to get this. I like all the bubble wrap. I'll tell you, I can use that. For other people. Ooh. All right, let's see. Hey, he did good on this one, man. Thank you. And if you can't tell, it's probably already. It's a fig work. Um. It was just a straight, easy trade we did. I just I needed this guy for mine. And it is Android 16. Need to hit me with my Android shelf. So, one down, two to go. Got to get 17 and 18. It's always the hard ones to get. So, Mauricio, thank you, brother. I appreciate you, man. Next up, courtesy of my boys, the Plastic Cannibals. This is from Ernest Pag Panganabon. We always call him Ernest P for a reason. We always butcher his name. Sorry if I butchered your name again for the umpteenth time. Um, but Ernest found these in his, I think it was Walmart. Um, and I said, I need those because this has a lot of, this has meaning to me too. Um, so, yeah, let me get this box open. Yeah. But yeah, the, uh, the cool thing being is, like I said, we always look out for each other, whether it be in the, the Cannibals, uh, the Syndicate, whatnot, Renegades. We all look out for each other in all these communities. And so I really appreciate the help because I can't find the stuff here to save my life. Um, if it's here, it's gone in two seconds. Um, but what we did get was refractor okay this is from siege we got not one but two now there's a reason why i need two i actually need three in total because if you get three of them you can actually build the camera when i was a kid i used to have the g1 uh reflector and it was a mail-in only um and i i got it and i remember having it so so, since that one's hard to find and get without paying an astronomical amount of price, wanted to go and go this route that we can at least still build a uh, reflector camera. So, so Ernest, thank you, brother. I really appreciate it, man. Uh, definitely one of these guys. Uh, so, if anybody sees an extra one, I need one more. Just need one more to build it. And then that one will be done. All right. Last box. Brother knife. That's a big box. Excuse me, somewhat big box. Um, this is courtesy of my boy, the Supreme Collector. So um, they've got a Facebook group out there, Supreme Collector, uh, buy, sell, and trade. Um, I did a lot of sales on there um, for all these sales I've been doing. Um, Thread pretty much by Brandon Wong. Uh, I've known Brandon for a long time. And Brandon had an extra one of these that somebody didn't need. So I said, let me get on that. Um, so let's open it up and see what Brandon sent Nate. Okay. 
Man, you did a great job taking this book, brother. Yeah, buddy. Ooh. And yes, it is in paper. And now it's out of the paper. So, free, um, yeah, so, Supreme Collector. Always loves stickers. Supreme Collector buy, sell, and trade. And, of course, he has the old SDCC one, Supreme Collector. Um, but, what we got is not a Transformer. Not even close. It is a Sentinel Ryobot Grindizer and Spacer uh, set. Um, I wanted this set for a while. My boy uh, Kuma Style Reviews, TJ, he did a review on it. I loved it, you know, when he did that. So it kind of sold it to me as well. Um, but definitely wanted this guy. Um, so needed a Grindizer. Gotta have a Grindizer in my set. So the only thing I need now is just a Mazinger and a Great Mazinger um, for the big robots that I like. Um, so excited for this guy. Can't wait to mess around with it. So thank you, Brandon, Supreme Collector. You guys are awesome. Um, that's it, people. That's today's haul and um, all, all pickups and uh, mail haul. So. It's been an awesome day. It's been an awesome week. We're going to have fun tomorrow night. So if you get a chance, say come by and join us. We're going to have fun. So you guys, all right, you guys know it. Go shop Toyco. Go check out my channel. If this is the first time you've been here, thank you for coming by. I appreciate each and every one of you for subscribing. Um, like I said, we got a little over a week still left on the giveaway for my last video. So probably around here you'll see it or here or something like that. I'll put an uh, image up for it. So yeah, we're still giving away that Studio Series um, Optimus Prime, courtesy of Figure Action. Um, but yeah, that's it this week, people. You guys take it easy and have a good one. I'll see you on the next one. All right, all right, all right. Look at that.